Hi guys, Wanda here. I am going to be painting this moth tonight. I don't know what's wrong with my eye. Have anybody else been having electronics problems today and yesterday? It is crazy the stuff that's going on. I don't know. Like, I send something to my printer, it goes to my husband's printer. <laughs> the car totally hijacks the phone. Just crazy stuff. Anyways, that's me complaining. So, <laughs> hello, spontaneous. <laughs> Let me grab Katie. Here she comes. I'm digging this moth that was stealing it. It's kind of hot in here. I'll just take it with you guys. Okay, so I'm going to Julie, is the picture on the post that I just made, you're more than welcome to print from there. Just save it to your gallery and then you can print it from there. Hi, Katie, Katie. Oh, shoot. You're ahead of me. You are um, uh, did the outline. Oh, no, I didn't. <laughs> Hi, Susan. I'm sorry. Go, go ahead. I'll wait. <laughs> I'll pretend. Okay, ready? Go. I'm, I'm pretending. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Good evening. I I thought that's what we were doing. I'm sorry. This was totally spontaneous, guys. So anyways, my ideas are, of course, you know, I love the watercolor. So I want to play with my neon some more. And I saw a pretty this pretty moth while surfing um what is it, Pinterest? Could you surf in Pinterest? <laughs> is that a thing, Katie? I, I live on Pinterest. <laughs> okay. Hi, Teresa and Marie. Let me see who's on here. Oops. Apparently, I don't know how to do it. <laughs> Hello, <I> everyone. Can... <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> Julie and Lisa and Lori. And Shay, hi, Karen, Susan. Hello everyone, Teresa and Marie. So uh, the same watercolors that I've been playing around with. And while Katie's doing her outline, I'll talk to you guys if you haven't done it before about how to make these. So it's a couple of ingredients and it's gum arabic and the pigment and then you need water and if you're going to make them like this and add them to a palette you really should add a drop of honey to keep bacterial growth out and just to make them smoother they're easier to deal with um this is an old eyeshadow palette from the dollar tree i just popped the eyeshadows out and then put my watercolors in there so i can have a small palette when i want one and to make them, basically, all you do, I have a glass tabletop under me, under me, under me, not under me, I'm not sitting on a table. <laughs> Anyways, under this, under this part here, under all of this is a big glass table. And that's where I meal the pigment with the gum arabic, but that's for this sort of storage. You can mix it in a dish like uh you know the palette <laughs> like this i did the other night these are watercolors made in in the palette um just right here just a little gum arabic a little bit of the pigment and then added water and this can all be reactivated so if you make it like this all you got to do is just grab a few drops of water and um, you're good to go. I'm looking for my pipette. <laughs> Your pipette. My pipette. <laughs> this thing. <laughs> this thing right here. All right. I'm going to grab some brushes. These are some round. They're called Snaps by Princeton. I'm really liking these for watercolor too. 
um, that's a number six and number two and a number zero. So I may or may not use these because I also adore the water brush by Pintel. It's a, what's it called? Aquash. Yeah. And this um, comes in many different ones, but I like the medium here. And then they have a small that I love as well. There it is. This one here is nice and pointy. I like to use these too. And I love using these for um, hand brush lettering. These are really good for that. And so I'm thinking I'm just going to probably stick with my watercolor palette here tonight and some lacy foils. So I'm going to show you my inspiration, even though it doesn't look neon, we're going to go with it. We're going to use the neons to make these because you can make almost any color with neon, believe it or not. Well, as you saw the skin the other day, who would have thought, right? <laughs> So if you um, wanted to do some watercolors along with this, um, that's basically how you do it. If you Hi, have Allison. Sorry. No worries. I'm just going to. I saw Hi, Katie, and I was like, ooh. Well. <laughs> no worries. So it's super simple, just uh, get it wet and it's ready to go, just like regular watercolor. See, nice and ready to go. All right, get to the rock back. How you doing, Katie Bugs? I'm Katie trying. <laughs> She's super kind. She's coming on for moral support because I had an inspiration and I didn't have a direction. So, <laughs> Well, I really wasn't doing anything and I finished off all of my little half projects that I needed to do earlier. And so I thought I actually messaged you and asked what you were going to do yeah and i was like are you going live <laughs> yeah of course somewhere <laughs> so and I'm then i just decided to crash you hey i'm cool with it i like being crashed. i'm just gonna work out some colors here while you're doing that so i'm grabbing some magenta and a little bit of the blue Trying to work out this color here ish. I'm liking that for that. Pretty close, yeah. What do you guys think? Oops, what are we talking about? I missed it. Oh, I'm all no no, I showed it. I didn't miss it. <laughs> Sorry. See the color? Oh yeah. That's super close. Now, what did you do? Because I was sketching. i sorry. You're so sketchy. I'll tell you. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, magenta and blue. Okay. And it's, uh, you know, not, not tons of blue, but enough to give us a bit. Magenta and blue. You ready? Okay. Yeah. Here we go, guys. So I'm basically just going to kind of start washing it in. I saw this rock and it was crying moss. Moss, moss. Isn't it? Am I crazy? Or... I'm adding a little more blue to it just because it was a little brighter than I wanted. 
And it's okay if we go over the moon because it's going to be black anyway. I think I'm going to go ahead and black out the, um, let me show you guys. Well, you guys have it. I think you saw on the, I'm going to go with the black areas that are on here. But I'm going to do them after we paint. So if you paint over it, no big thing. And the cool thing is, is um, my inspiration for the color. It's sort of Susan's like, over here talking about fresh pasta and spaghetti dinner. <laughs> Good. That's what it's about. We're just chatting and hanging out. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Oh, my gosh. I had chicken marsala for dinner, and I made this uh, fettuccine with fresh crushed garlic and parmesan and butter and you know all that heart attack happened in food but it was so dang good my son asked for seconds and that is a huge compliment so yes i'm tooting my horn toot toot <laughs> you're killing me i made italian subs for dinner oh yummy though yum yum <laughs> <laughs> okay so i just added a little more blue so more now it's, blue? Like, it's more on the lavender side now maybe purpley yeah and I'm just going to start going on these outer uh, portions here. These bottom ones are going to be black, so we don't have to really worry about that. I reserve the right to change my mind also. <laughs> I'm one of those mix on the palette paint people, you know what I mean? Instead of mixing the tray, sometimes I'll mix on the rock a lot. Change it. Watercolor is super forgiving that way. Like you can really change it up or pull it off or, you know. Yeah. Maybe that's why I like it because I feel like I'm not married to it if I'm, if it's not working for me, right? All right, I'm going back with the magenta, mixing it back in. And I'm just going to pull it out probably kind of to like this, like a, imagine a circle here. But from the purple, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So if we were to go like. Don't, um, this is going to, I think it's going to stay lighter. So inside the moon here. So are you doing straight magenta on that outside wing? No, it was the mixture left on the palette and then I added magenta to it just a bit. And then I watered it down. Can you see my palette? Sorry. Palette. Not really. Sorry. <laughs> That's okay. Is better? Is that yeah. Better? Okay. Oh, wow, I'm just catching it. So that would cool one, Susan, using clean wrap to so you can just throw it out and you're done. Yeah, I've seen people doing that, and some people use foil, too. Cool. But I just use my handy-dandy butcher paper <laughs> or freezer paper. I'm liking that, too. I've been using leftover labels from my mailings. Yeah. Not the label, but the peely, the backside, you know? Oh. 
I'm throwing my brush around. The leftover backsides of the mailing labels, the sticker backs. Oh yeah, I remember stacking all those up together. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> hey, thanks for that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now I'm going to come in with some blue. I'm going to pull some blue into my palette. Okay. Oh, we weren't going all the way down? Um, I'm going to kind of do this outer part. It's okay because you can turn it blue easily. It's not, you can. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, however you want to do it. So I'm going to go blue, but I want it more on the, what is that, periwinkle side of blue? So just a mid of purple. Okay, you did blue and what? <laughs> just a smidge of the magenta-ish color to give it that more of a, I don't even know what the color is. <laughs> it's less of a blue-blue and more of a purpley periwinkle-ish light blue. I'm just gonna come in with that down here. It's a little dark for periwinkle, but. And then I'm going to go into a bluer. Bluer than blue. What is that song? Bluer than blue, sadder than sad. I just realized I forgot a whole little section on my moth. Oh dear. It's okay. It's Easy fix. It's fix. a unique moth, right? <laughs> Easy fix. Hi, Robin and Rhonda and Allison, Teresa and Teresa and Joyce and Susan. Wow, guys. Hello, everyone. So little impromptu painting this evening. So I think I'm gonna use green. Mix with the blue that's up here or that I was looking at. Hey, with. you missed one too. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. Okay. Where? On that bottom right wing in the middle of the O, you missed one little loopy. I do not see it, but I believe you. <laughs> Show me on yours so I can see. This one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Not See, no <laughs> Thank you, Susan. I saw the eyelashes, Allison. That was bad to the bone. That sister. was so cool. Yes. I saw it totally. I have to pick up some and, you know, we're going to have to incorporate that into 3D. <laughs> Thank you. That, See, I love, I love that when you guys share, you know, your fun addition with with us. It's so great. 
<clears throat> All right. So I'm going to add some blue out here. I'm blending on the fly. I mean, on the moth. <laughs> that was my attempt at humor. I got it. <laughs> Did you know? Oops, I was still wet. Oh well, so now we have gray. That's okay because uh, that might actually work. Oh, I'm liking it. Beautiful, Katie. Yours is like so like um like galaxy. So perfect for the moon. <laughs> like I you know, I kind of was looking at that when we were looking at moss. I was like, ooh, I saw some ooh. galaxy ones that looked awesome. I did too, but I am so like, see, you guys found a, a thing I'm not com confident with. <laughs> It's, um, I have, every time I've ever tried like one, it's never, it's not come out very well, <laughs> but the way you're, it's coming on your, it's looking so good. I love doing galaxies. Well, I'm thinking a collab, a galaxy, feeling it coming up. <laughs> Yeah, maybe, maybe. What? What do you think? Show For us sure. how. Show us how it's done. All right. Well, that's drawing. Oh no, I want to do. I'm gonna make like a gray, green. Let me see if I can do it. What do you have color wise? You have. Huh? I'm trying to see what you have color wise because I want to make like a a gray green. I know that's a strange color, but um oh a little black would be good. Just do you, you have black, right? Just even black posca just like this. Oh yeah. Just like that. There we go. Maybe even darker. Improvisation. Who said it's just for comedians, right? <laughs> there we go. Okay, 
And then I'm going to start up here and start adding the black details. So the moon, I'm going to make that black or crescent, right? <laughs> Making me hungry. The croissant. Oops, it almost touched. <laughs> Mine got a little close there <laughs> where my moon in the middle up here. I can't see because there's a glare from my light. So oh. I was going with it. <laughs> so it's okay. We're a little tight up here. <laughs> Hi, Dawn. I hope I'm in the right place. I'm trying to see it, but. And of course, you know, on these little circles down here, I'm putting rhinestones there. Oh yeah. <laughs> They're perfect. It's like they were built for me, huh? Mm hmm It was Wanda. Is that what you said? No. Who said that? I always get blamed for everything. So. <laughs> I'm <laughs> I'm okay with that. Uh oh. What's the matter? <laughs> oh what? I was just getting a drink. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm a little behind because I was having to finish, so. I am totally slow at this where you are fast, so you'll catch me. Trust me. you catch me. <laughs> hey, Cindy. <laughs> oh, Cindy got a new storage cart. You know what that Ooh. means, right? <laughs> Shopping. Yeah, it means she's out you of room. <laughs> I just recently had to do some reorganizing myself and I had to move my foil to a larger drawer because oh. I had too <laughs> much foil there is no such thing <laughs> well, in my little tiny space, there is a such thing. No, I'm sorry. You have to move something else out. There's no such thing. What else are you doing black? Um, oh, these little mid doopy dupes. Yeah. Do you have the original still? Um, I can. I'm doing the black that was on that one. Hang on, I'll pop it out here and show you. So all of this. Yeah. That, the moon. Gotcha. Eyeballs. I'm contemplating dot, dotalism or pointillism. <laughs> dotalism. <laughs> That's a thing too. Oh, is it? Okay. Pointillism. Yeah. Some pointillism. I love the way that looks. We can do it in white or in black. 
on yours, I think it would look really awesome in white because you have like this whole galaxy theme going on over there. I'm feeling the vibe. Yep. Titi, hi. Um, Allison, I have a little tiny desk in my bedroom that I'm sitting at. <laughs> and I have two carts that sit here with me out in the middle of the floor. And I just reorganized. I'll have to show y'all. It's, it's pretty um, creative. I did it uh, with stuff from the Dollar Tree. But I'm pretty packed in here. <laughs> Hi, Nancy. You're in the lounge, Allison. Seriously, you took us to the bar? I'm okay with that. <laughs> Yay! Party! <laughs> I'm not drinking tonight. I'm behaving. <laughs> I think um, we're all up for another Bloody Mary night, Katie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know though. It's like Why it's, hate? it's not good to mix that and a troll. And it, oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'm yeah, just afraid yeah. if I'm drinking and I get another troll, I'm gonna be not so nice again the next time. <laughs> hey, if oh, they can you. you. <laughs> I'm get I'm smudging my color all over the place. I, I just did the same thing, so I had to clean mine up too. Hi, Deborah. Hello, hello. Ah, that's a lot, Allison. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have all rock stuff, so I'm good. I'm having I'm gonna have to switch pins because this. Is not wanting to color over my watercolor very well. I just made a mess of mine too. So. Or not like, yeah, it's a mess. <laughs> okay, switching. <laughs> You're right, Lori. You are so right. I'm wondering if I'm going to have to go spray this, Wanda. Spray it? Yeah, because none of my uh, liners want to work on top of this watercolor. Mine are, my Posca is working. I'm, okay. Yeah, I mean, spraying, it's cool, though. I'm, I'm going to have to spray mine, too, before I resin it. Just break, girl. Well, I'm being hard headed. <laughs> well, if it's don't ruin a pin though either, you know. That's being hard headed. That's what I do. Don't do that. So guys, if um the struggle is real, <laughs> right? If your pens aren't working, try spraying, letting it set dry, and then um, using your pens on top of that, because usually that fixes the whole problem. Right, yep. Katie? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. You know, it could very well be when I made yours, I used more gum Arabic too. As simple as I that. I see. 
<laughs> maybe <laughs> strumming a little um more you know oomph to it you're sabotaging me i'm sorry i love the way this is coming it's almost velvety like when you add the black into it hi pam you're not too late we well i guess you are a little bit we <laughs> haven't really done that much <laughs> no. No. well pam i sprung it on everyone again it's the i get a little inspiration and then i just i need company so thank you all for <laughs> joining me and katie and i just crashed her party i like uh, that better than partying alone right <laughs> but that's no fun Hi, Trina. Hi, Trina. So guys, I'm thinking um, black foil, lacy foil too. Kind of like the celebration, but maybe not so crazy. <laughs> oh dear, she brings up the celebration. Oh no. <laughs> That's hilarious. I hope you love our lives so much. Oh, thank you, Lori. I just act like my dorky self. I can't. My dorky, boring self. You're not dorky. I am, but I'm I'm a proud dorky dork. You're my funky dorky friend. Like it. <laughs> At least you're not crazy. I'm the cray cray. You're the funky fun. <laughs> I'm having to go over all of this, Mama Mia. Me too. Would it be faster if we use brush and um, like black paint or? For you, maybe for me, it would be a disaster. Oh. Because <laughs> I, I don't have a very steady hand and when I use that black ink and a brush, it like goes everywhere. But you're pretty, you're pretty good with it, so. I feel like um, it dries so fast that I can control it better. I don't know. Maybe that. Yeah, because you use that ink, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. At least I've been using it. I'm, st I'm really starting to lean toward like liking it like for almost everything black. It's so black and it's just one coat and it's thin, you know, it doesn't really mess up any, anything. Whoops. 
went out of the lines. It's okay, color outside of the lines, right? Mm -hmm. I agree, Lori Katie's perfect. Oh, y'all are crazy. I'm nowhere near perfect, but thank you. Love show. So Lori has a really favorite song, or at least I think it's one of her favorites. <laughs> I'm going to tell on you, Lori. Uh, Farrah Williams, Happy. And I have that song so stuck in my head, and it's the coolest song ever. If you got to have a song stuck in your head, that's the one to have. It and it does you, stick in your yeah. head. <laughs> it just makes you want to go dance, like be silly, you know? I I've got to put that on my playlist. <laughs> yes. I turned, I pulled it up on YouTube tonight and then while I was cooking dinner and I was playing it and then, you know, because I pulled it up, it started, YouTube starts picking out similar things that you might like. So then a whole bunch of fun songs came on and it was, um, Oh, what's it? Now, see, now I'm drawing a blank. Oh, my gosh. What's that song? Saturday night and we're in the spot. Something. You don't believe me, this watch. <laughs> what's that song? And then um, the one from Trolls. Anybody see that? animation movie trolls i didn't because i'm not really into animated i know kill me now <laughs> i'm like what <laughs> no <laughs> you love trolls i think you would really dig it <laughs> why because i have hair like a troll <laughs> no. Because you're happy, fun, like a troll. <laughs> Uptown Funk. Yes, that's the one. Uptown Funk. Yeah, I don't even want to go there. That song, make, <laughs> if I start singing that, y'all be thinking I'm swearing. <laughs> My son thought I was saying the F word for the longest time. What? Farrah Williams, I'm so happy. I did it. <laughs> there it goes, stuck in your head. Because I'm happy. See, they can't shut us down for singing it. <laughs> yeah. You don't want me to sing. We need to get Risa to make some music for us. I don't know. Do you think they would still shut it down? If it's her music, no. Isn't doesn't she have a band? Yeah. Lisa? Right. I mean a boo boo. Boo boo boo. Okay. See my boo boo? <laughs> Say bye yeah, bye boo boo. It's a little baby one. <laughs> And now it's gone. Bye-bye, boo-boo. There's that lovely sound, y'all. Don't you love it? Scratch, scratch, scratch. I don't know what I'm going to do with this part of the face right here. Should I just do it black? I was wondering that myself. I haven't made up my mind. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, maybe just dark, maybe just dark, um, purple. Blue. We could do it like 
I guess it's too small to do that, but I was thinking a chrome color would be pretty on yeah. that. That would be. Do that, make it black and then we'll do it chrome. But we're gonna do the eye, I'm doing the eyeballs with foil. <laughs> the eyeballs? Mm-hmm. What kind of foil? Eyeball foil. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> eyeball foil? I don't have that one. It's the foil I love to do on eyeballs, buggy eyeballs, because it has little dots on it like buggy eyeballs have, you know? Oh, okay. I'm following your lead. Okay, I'm going to grab it. Oh, I think I did already. <laughs> it's eyeball foil. Do I don't even know if I have it. Anything? Yeah, you do. You have this set. So you're not doing the little triangle diamond thing in there, center? I am, but I need to do the eyeballs first. Oh, gotcha. I can see them, and then I'll paint it black. And... <laughs> yeah. Ooh, I have this little piece right here that I used for the eyeballs last time, but see the little dots? Yeah. <laughs> Glory. Hi, Daphne. All right, I'm getting gloves on. Sitting up to paint. I got to do a little scraping real quick. Sorry, guys. It's going to yeah. kill y'all. It's going to be cool. Man, if you get ahead of me and you start uh, doing your foiling, I'll never catch up. Oh, wait. I'm just getting green in my dish. and Because you know, just you go to town. Them. <laughs> Do you have black foil, uh, lacy foils? I'm pretty sure. Okay. Is that going to go with my... um? galaxy theme I got going on here? Um, no. No, it won't. Or it might, but you do your galaxy thing. Look, I was thinking in the circles, do you have the galaxy foils? Do you have any of those? Let me put out, pull out my big old drawer here. <laughs> what do the galaxy look like? There's the eyeball one. There's this set. Oh, I don't know why that's not looking familiar. I'm looking though. And where's my other one? And then there's that. By the way, these are options on the list of whales that I have access to on the voting poll. Yeah. The galaxy foils are so mean. Uh oh, what does that mean? They're mean. That means they're not going to work right. They're not. Sorry. I have this, but I don't yes. know. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was thinking um, in here. 
Yeah. To do a little galaxy. Like a little galaxy foil. Uh huh. Okie dokie. Are you going to do the white, um, like stars and stuff? Um, I do have in this new set that I got, I have the hologram, it's stars. Okay. And look, you guys, in this galaxy box, look, I saw a demon in there. Can you see it? See, I don't have that. But that, that looks scary. <laughs> Doesn't it? It's like, it's not the only one either. Like, there's That's another creepy. monster right here. See it? Can you see that face? The eyes and the mouth and the tongue sticking out? And the horns up here wrapping around? Well, I must be like, my karma's bad. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh my gosh, here's another monster on the other galaxy one. What is going on? Oh, that's pretty. See, look. I like that. Um, yes, please. Oh, I forgot about those foils. Oh, I haven't even opened them. Hello. <laughs> this has flowers. Oh, yeah. I forgot about these. <laughs> is this the one? Yes, this is the one. Paisley, you just opened. hearts. So stars. Ooh, the stars are good. There's one with butterflies. Ooh, these aren't very long, though, huh, on the foils. Well, I knew there would be an issue because we actually found them, and <laughs> it's okay. Now I, I'm there's kidding. not that Let much. Me, I'll measure it. Oh no, gosh, no, there's not at all. I'll tell you, my thing set up for a hundred right here. So this is about six centimeters. Well, is this enough to do my moth? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Man, that's kind of disappointing. I I want to go back and read what they say you get because I've never actually seen them this short in a box before, you know? Like, usually you get the short ones in the packs with no box. I should have known there was going to be something shysty about it. It's it's not. You know what? It's not. It's not shysty. They're beautiful foils. So maybe you just get they're they're just if it's short. If it's what I think they're expensive from the distributor, that's why I have some that are like double the cost of the others because they're really expensive. Can you get something it's like this with stars? I can get all of these prints. I just haven't found them in holographic. I found them in black oh. and it's on my list. Yeah, I'm still looking. I'm on the hunt. <laughs> For sure. So are you doing stars? Yeah, but did do you think I should still do the the galaxy and the little inside thing? I don't know if that'll even show up. Which ga what galaxy do you have? I just have these, and they're not real easy to do. Yeah, those are kind of a, a pain in the rumpus. We can skip the galaxy in there. What do you really want to do in there, though? Right, I'm ready to do the eyes. You ready? We'll come back to it. Okay, un moment. Un moment. Hey, hey, thank you. Susan needs the star one for her. <laughs> Here's Lori again. <laughs> they are mean foils. foils. That's what she's talking about. <laughs> but Lori must have experimented. <laughs> well, I thing. must not love them because I don't. I haven't really <laughs> taken care of them. Oh my God. <laughs> wow.
Okay, I so we're gonna do we can make them thick though. We know we know the secret, don't we? We're gonna do eyeballs. I mean glue, right? Yes. Do you have um, Dottie's buggy? Yes, ma'am. I pulled it out. Good. So see what I did here? I cut like a notched out. I cut out a flower in a notch. Can you see that? Yeah, yeah. Now I'm going to put it right like that where the eyes are. Oh, nope, I'm going to get a flower on it. So <laughs> I got to move it over a bit. Yeah, go on the other side. Anyways, my idea was. There we go. Oh, I need gloves. <laughs> Bring it. I'm bringing it. Hey, Julie. Welcome back. Hello. The scary movie's happening at your house, Katie. What? <laughs> it sounds like a scary movie at your house. It's like, <laughs> Oh, that's my chair. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like, oh, God, who's in the closet? <laughs> I oh, love and my movies. closet. It's the closet and my chair. Everything squeaks in here, man. I love scary movies, so that's like, yeah. <laughs> you guys could totally have me going for Halloween, by the way. <laughs> I would be like freaked out totally. Okay. I know a lot of y'all aren't ready for it, but I'm kind of looking forward to all the cool fall and Halloween and stuff that we can do things that we can do. I am so ready for it. <laughs> I'm ready for Halloween. I want to do some awesome Sugar skulls. Are you guys ready for some sugar skulls? <laughs> I'm so ready. Yeah, me too. Hold my beer. <laughs> oh, Lori. I... Oh, my God, girl. Hold my beer. <laughs> She's going to make a galaxy foil stick. <laughs> That's me, right? I get you. I feel you. <laughs> we got bug eyes. Bug eyes are in the house. I think if I handed out rocks here, I would have them thrown at me. Oh, here too. We the got the people in this neighborhood just. They're not cool. In my neighborhood, they might TP our house because they're all. Well, we have people come into our neighborhood from the other neighborhoods. Yeah, because we got the chocolate. Because <laughs> you have the nice, the good stuff. We got the good candy. <laughs> so we have all kinds of traffic on Halloween. It's nuts. <laughs> I know where to come then. <laughs> they got to fight me for it, though, at my door. I'm like, no, you can't have the Reese's. No, sorry. That's my, mine here. Two for me, one for you. See, I keep finding spots. That's why I like my ink. <laughs> but don't get me wrong. I love Posca. I just can't. I guess I have a problem with seeing it while it's wet. You know, where it's wet, <clears throat> where I put it. I should probably be wearing my glasses. <gasps> yeah, I should probably wear my glasses.
<laughs> Melissa's coming to visit for the full size candies. Now Come we're going to start telling you. Put your glasses <laughs> on, Wanda. Okay, Hi. the eyes are done. Hi, Lonnie. Okay, so did we decide? Are we doing stars on the rest? Yeah. Or do I'm, we do like I'm all four? Four? I'm all four stars. You want to do a combo? <laughs> No. Like what? Yeah. Like what? <laughs> like maybe stars around this part here in this area. Uh huh. So let me just map it out real quick. So like stars here. And there's these pretty lacy holographic. It might be a little busy though. See those? Yeah. Maybe. Those are too big. Too. I want some lacy lacy, but these are kind of big lacy. You're on the lace thing. Isn't that pretty though? But it's too much. The, it's too covered. So we can do polka dots or meshed. What if we use the colored the colored one? Is that too you were wanting lace. The black, yeah, let's mix black with the um, the hollow. You go with it? Yeah. Which one, though? I know, right? I don't know which ones you have. <laughs> but it doesn't have, have to match, just if they're black, you know? I have the black and white mix. Yeah, these, like, ones with lots of room in them, you know? I'm out of polka dots. So. Oh, do you have this? Oh, I'm dropping them everywhere. Do you have this set right here? Um, I don't think so. Let me look though. Hi, Monica. Oh, I think I got to do that one. I hope you have it. I don't think I have it, Wanda. No. <laughs> okay. But, I, but you can do it. I can do something else. What do you have that's like kind of? Well, you, yeah, you can do whatever you want. I was thinking just sparsely, not sparsely, but a foil you could see through, you know? Yeah. Do you have one like that? I'm, I'm looking because I have some that, that are um, just loose. There's no foil stuck to me. None. Wait, Lori says that one. Are you talking to Katie? Oh, those lacy ones in your hand. Do you have the black ones like the one on top? See the beige one on top? I don't that think so. There's black ones inside there, I believe. It's beige, black, and hollow in that pack. Yes. Oh. Open it. <laughs> I don't even have it open. <laughs> I thought it was all the same color, which I don't do beige, so. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's three yummy colors, and they look really pretty together. Yes, Lori. Yes, yes, this one, yes. The white or the, which one? Is there black? Yes, that one. That's it, right there. That's the one. Do you but like it? But that's not the same as yours. Well, no, it's not the same, but it's, um, 
you can it's a nice pattern that you can see through yeah if these you, are little shorties too yeah well those those are the sample strip packs oh okay yeah i never realized there was more than one color in that packet oh yeah you have the round lace in there too <laughs> oh that one you like that one any better Yeah, actually, well, I don't know because I think that round is going to look weird because you're only going to get part of it in there. Mm -hmm. I think I'll stick with the one I have. Okay. Houston, I think we have a winner. See, I told you I had so many <laughs> little pouches here that I never really get into. I probably have more than I know. I'm pretty uh, familiar with probably, I don't, I don't want to release maybe 80% of all the foils out there. <laughs> Not that I own them all, but that I have chopped them all. I know which ones are not good. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Okay, ready. Okay, so let's do the fun hollow first. I'm thinking on the color, um, only in the black. Um, maybe we could do white dots to represent stars or something, like galaxy stars. Yeah. Like with, with a pen, not, not a foil. Oh, lovely. My nail glue gel. Can you guys see that? And this is what happens when you leave it. <laughs> Sorry, I was having to reline something. All right. I'm just going to use my little flashlight safe. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever get sick of the way the neons glow on the rock. <laughs> So cool. I'm back. Who said that? Lonnie. I don't know which side of this is the right side. I can't feel it with my glove either. Ah, okay, wish me luck, y'all. Because if it ain't the right side, I'm going to cry. I'm also hitting the top of my foil with the light before I pull up on it, just to give it a little extra. Well, that is beautiful foil. Yes, it is. Holy mackerel. Good choice, Miss Katie. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Guys, it's beautiful. Hi, Teresa. Multitasking is not a bad thing, Lonnie. <laughs> Hi, I wish Teresa. I could do that.
Thanks, Lori. Thank you, thank you. Don't get it on fire. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Yes, we. I don't know if it is on the latest list because we kind of just found it. Oh, this foil? Yeah. Yeah. It's, um, we're still having a love hate with it. It's hard to find. We found it from another manufacturer, I guess you could say, and it's good, but it's not very much foil. Yeah. So is it worth the price is my question. Do I can't remember how much it was. It wasn't very much, was it? It was like it was like eight eight sixty five. Yeah, that's not a bad price. It comes with a box. It's cheaper than my stuff. But it's also flint it's beautiful foil, don't get me wrong, but it's thin. You can tell. The foil is thin. You can feel the you know, it's thin. Um for a printed foil, it's really thin. Mm -hmm. You know, like the transparent ones that, that I use all the time, the clear ones? Let me show yeah. you. These should always be very thin, just very, very thin. Yeah. And that's what these are like. These are on that type of thin release. I feel like printed stuff ought to be on a sturdier plastic like these are, Katie, your Yeah. Yeah. Like my um the special foils are on a sturdy plastic compared to these. This is really, really onion paper thin and these are like transparency film ish. Right. So gotcha. But the print on them is not bad but they can get damaged really easily so if like if like i found wine. them huh, yeah if i found them for sale it would um it could damage them me shipping them because i have to fold my foils in an envelope right because I'm not a mass distributor, so I can't afford boxes. I don't know how they afford the box and the foil for that. You know, they do sell them for a reasonable price. This set reminds me of the black set that I just ran out of. It had the black polka dots and the black mesh, and it had these blacks, this in black too in it. See, that's what I kept finding was I could find black and white no problem, mm -hmm. but I couldn't find this hologram until uh, Jennifer actually found this and sent me the link. Thank you, Jennifer. I think she's on too. And I was like, give me the leak. Well, she <laughs> said she found it and I was like, give me the leak. <laughs> <laughs> like some I, crazy foil person. I quickly ran out and bought two myself. <laughs> hey, Margie. Must have foil. Hi, Margie. Welcome home. Thank you. 
They are easy release though. They're real nice. They're working really well. Yeah, they definitely do easy release. I'm not having near the trouble I usually yeah. have. Yeah, no trouble. They have very, actually the quality here is really, really great. I take it back. So now we must ask them, why do you not give us enough oil? <laughs> You're off camera, Katie. Bugs. Oh. Ooh, sorry, crazy. no one said anything. I didn't. I was in my own little world. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm fired. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, you're not. <laughs> you're not allowed to be fired. <laughs> I'd fire myself first. <laughs> Isn't it, Lonnie? It's so beautiful. This whole box of foil is so gorgeous. Of course, well, I'll pop the link in there afterwards. Wasn't it? Didn't it sell out once already? And then does it say available soon again? Something like that? No, that's the Buranos. Oh, the Buranos. See, I'm getting confused. In case y'all didn't get Buranos, it, it's back up there, but it just says available soon. If you order it, I think it comes in September or October. That's a long time. I know. I put it in my buggy and I was like, I can't wait that long. <laughs> Not that I even need it, but now I'm scared because I, you know, I need a backup because that's the coolest, coolest stuff ever. That's weird. We got to Crap. We got to get you. We got to get you one somehow. <laughs> yeah, I know. I missed out on that deal because I was waiting for payday. Then payday came and it's gone. That's the bad thing. It happens to me all the time. All the time. I'll want something and think, okay, I, I'm going to wait for payday. And then lo and behold, I go to get it and it's sold out. I'm so in love. <laughs> mm. Mm-hmm. See, this is what uh, unicorns are made of <laughs> right here. Mm. We haven't done a unicorn. We should add that to our list. Oh, I see what you're doing there. Eh. <laughs> That's a good idea. We could go ahead and tell them our plans for Friday if you want. Yeah, go for it. So on Friday for our collab, um, we are doing Expedia. Whoa, your and, sound just dimmed out. Huh? Your sound just dimmed out. Oh, can you hear me? Can you guys hear Katie or is it just on my end? Talk. They'll be back, Margie. Oh, They'll be back. You there you are. You're back. Um. On Friday for our collab, um, we are doing mixed media. So what, what we're going to do is we're going to decoupage our rock prior to, we're going to do one on the collab on Friday, but we're going to have one already done because of the dry time. Um, and so, yeah. And we might video, I'm or, or I might video or will video what we do prior to and maybe post it and that way if you want to get your rock ready by Friday you'll be able to. Oh, that's a good idea. I think about that. Good one. 
And then we're going to do um, fantasy. So um, I'm not sure where I'm going with that yet, but it's probably going to involve a face and an ear and hair and eyes and nose and mouth and all of that good stuff. That sounds fun. That's not what you said earlier. You were like, excuse me, what? <laughs> well, I, I fell apart at the draw part. <laughs> Katie said, we're well, drawing a face. <laughs> well, like, we're what? drawing a fairy elf <laughs> thing. All I heard was drawing. <laughs> but then I told her, but we are mixed media. So if you want to use another form, like a tattoo or uh, I don't know what else, just a, a sketch, I guess, right? Um, like you do with the... Like tracing? Tracing, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm all, yep, I could handle that. I will try drawing. I will try it tomorrow. And if it don't work, then I'm, mm. You'll have a backup. Yeah. Because seriously, I, I have issues there. I'm not saying I can't do it. I'm just saying it's um, debatable. <laughs> I don't like it when I hear people say they can't. So I'm not saying that. Yeah, we'll, I, we'll share the moth drawing. Yeah, the, um, it's the picture, you guys, that I posted for the live. That's it. Uh, download it and print it or screenshot it and print it. That's the picture. It took me a minute to get it sized right. I'm still learning how to size my stuff right. Mine's a, yeah, it changes every rock, you know. Um, Allison, it, I can post it, um, again after the live, or maybe if Julie's on, maybe she can grab it for you. I haven't seen her say anything recently, so I don't know if she's on. She said she was back, but I hadn't seen her. In a minute. Good night, Teresa. Thanks for Bye, joining Teresa. us. All right. Okay, I'm gonna go up that side with the black now, just so okay. I can see the whole thing, the whole look. That way, if uh, we lose people, they can see what the other side's gonna look like. <laughs> okay, good idea. Get back up there. So with the mixed media that we're going to be doing, we're going to be decoupaging, possibly stamping, um, using um, bubble wrap to make dots, um, possibly an old gift card or credit card that you have to make lines. Mm. Cool ideas. Um, hey, if anybody bought anything from the uh, Solar Color Dust Company lately, they sent these cool little glitter hippo cards. Do you remember those cool little glitter hippo cards, Katie? They're yeah. About that, they're business card about that big, but they're the hard plastic like a credit card. Yeah. Mine. Tell Lonnie's asking about Burano pins, what oh, they are. It's a powder pen. It's a powder chrome pen. Open. Oh, they twist. That's right. <laughs> Sorry. It's got a sponge tip applicator. 
and they're total color shifty. Come on, focus. Melissa Clifton made a post recently. She used them and I, you can see the shift in her post. Amazing. It, they're beautiful. And they're highly pigmented and not a lot of money, like $17 for six of them. All of these. Oh, you have them. Okay. Well, get them out. <laughs> Sister, we got to have talk. <laughs> Yay. Oh, I love it. Look. Ain't it pretty? Yep. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm digging it. Okay, I have to do it. I, I hate it, but look. <laughs> Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah. It happens when, uh, this is what overhead lighting does to your nail glue. If you leave it for too long, that just shows you that there is UV light in all light. I'm trying to use every other part of it. <laughs> So our science experiment includes snot. <laughs> That's from the other day. <laughs> so brutal. Thank you, Shay. <laughs> Who's laughing? I love it. Thank you. <laughs> oh, Shay, thanks. I know that was crude. Did we lose you, Katie? Sorry, I was concentrating. It's okay. This uh -oh. stuff is a little more complicated. Is it? It's not. It's not going on like the other one. Beautifully okay. did. Maybe you have a, a different foil. Use your flashlight on top of it. Maybe. Well, it pulls. It pulls it up. It's just it doesn't. I don't know. Hold it up there it, so I can. It see. kind of. It kind of looks like some kind of characters or something rather than. Oh, I see. So around the edges, maybe the um, the uh, dotting tool will lay it down to the glue on the sides. That's what it looks like. It's not grabbing your glue in here. Okay, so I need to get a dotting tool out. It may or may not. I don't know. Some foils are just, you know, <laughs> you know. <laughs> oh, I know. What did Lori call it? <laughs> mean. <laughs> the mean foil. I call them temperamental. She calls them mean. <laughs> the other ones were so good. Isn't it crazy the difference between foil? <laughs> mean. Ooh. Yay. Susan, you're doing a fairy house, right? I think. Yay, right. Yes. She makes the most beautiful fairy house.
I know you guys, sometimes I don't say a lot in the group, but I do read everything. Sometimes I don't have time to comment on everything, but I keep an eye on you guys. <laughs> I know what you're up to. If I comment on everything, I get put in jail again. Me too. It's so silly. We got to pick and choose, you know, so I try to answer questions first and then, you know, of course, I love every single piece of art that I see. I do. I love it all. But sometimes we don't have, they will put us in jail for being too active. It's the stupidest thing. Like when I do a live, if I, um, if I don't do it in the event now, the only way I can tag all of you guys is in an event because it sends it to anybody who is my friend. If you're not on my friend list, then don't get it. <laughs> That's the only way I could do it. I couldn't even make a chat room big enough because there's like 350 of you that wanted to be on that list. Yeah, and when I tried that chat group thing before, it would only let eight people in. They say, they say it allows 50, but I have yet to see that happen. I get grounded before I even get there. Like about 20 invites, then I'm put on probation and they won't let me post any more messages. <laughs> You've nicknamed the moon and the stars. I like it. All right, let's kick it in the butt here. See, I think you're ahead of me now. <laughs> Pretty. Okay, I need some more foil. Board. What are we doing in the center? I don't know. I'm thinking transparent foil. Or let me think about this one like. Oh, yeah. Maybe. And then maybe some stuff, you know, like rhinestones or I don't know. So are we doing the stars down here too? Are you doing oh, the stars on the bottom under? I hadn't even thought about what we're doing in that section. Oh, shoot. I just. I glued it. Oops. Hi, Ken. Thank you. Welcome to the group. <laughs> Definitely welcome. I'm so glad we got to meet you in here. So you're going to do the stars down there? I don't know. <laughs> Contemplating I think we should do something different, don't you? Yes, me too. What do you I just do? don't know what. You want to do polka dots or mesh? Let's do mesh because of the under ones. This one. Oh, okay, gotcha. It'll be like fishnet stockings. <laughs> 
<laughs> I was thinking that or some white lace because we're doing the black lace on top and do the white lace underneath. But that's a good idea. I think, do you have this in white? I think I have this in white. I don't know if I have that in white. Oh, or that, oh, I like this one better. Eh, you might not have it though, but I think I like it. Thank you. Yeah, that's pretty. And I can tell you right now, I doubt I have that, but you use it. I can find something else. Okay, I'm going to use it. You do you. You do you. <laughs> oh, that's really pretty. Great idea. Look at it. Awesome. Yeah. Both. Go. Hey, Melissa, thank you. Thank you, Miss Lori. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm making a mess with my glue here. Uh oh, you better be careful. No, I mean, it's on my rock. I'm just going out of the lines, which irritates me, you know? <laughs> yeah. I don't like it when they go together, but it's okay. Mine went together down here at the bottom too, but that's what black is for. Yep. Touch it up. Yeah, just do it. Hi, Kate. Oh, and I didn't mention rhinestones. We can do rhinestones or anything like that. Cogs, anything in the mixed media. Yes. You can use watercolors, ink tints, um, art crayons, paint pens. You name it. I'll probably use a little bit if I do the face and it, it's working out well. I'll probably do a little bit of the art crayons because I love doing a face with art crayons. I need to get them. <laughs> well, put them on my, oh my goodness, wish list. <laughs> Those are by Derwent too? No. Oh. I have a few of the Marabous. They're expensive, but I bought, I have bought them one at a time at Michael's with a coupon, but I have a set that's pretty decent. That's the same brand as your woodless watercolor. King Art. King Art. Yeah. That are pretty King. decent. 
right on. Good to know. So but they mix really well with gesso and make blending a breeze. That's important when it comes to skin. <laughs> but also I'm a little bit of a rebel and I like using my alcohol inks mm. uh, with some <laughs> gesso too, so. But you scare, you're scaring me. <laughs> okay, we'll start simple. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. Woo. Welcome. Hi, Kathy. <laughs> Ooh, how do you like them, Lori? Lori got the marabou, the king art and the marabou skin tones. Lucky lady. Cool. She was prepping. Mm-hmm. Well, I for surely won't have them by this weekend, but I will have my watercolors, which I'm okay with doing skin, so. Yeah, you got that down. I'm more of the pick this color, pick that color, and put it on. However, I'm good with it on straight rock. I don't know if I'm good with it like on top of whatever we're doing, decoupage or something. Oh, you'll it'll be okay on de decoupage. You're not going to have anything to worry about. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Well, I definitely will do that then if you need some guidance. Not that I'm like the wizard or anything. I haven't done them a ton, but I think I have the gist. Of the, of the, um, the art pens, what are they called? <laughs> art crayons. And when, yeah. but when you start using them, they're like butter. They just go on like butter. See that? I, you won me at butter. <laughs> yeah, they do. And and then blending with a little bit of gesso, it's just, you're like, where have I been? I've been trying to do, I have, I was trying to do faces with acrylic. And I was struggling. And then when I saw someone using the art crayons and mixing gesso with it and stuff, I was like, okay, I'm going to try it. And I just, I fell in love. Oh man, I feel another uh, shopping moment coming up. <laughs> it's all good. I need skin stuff anyway, so. They have a good range though, like all the colors. Well, this is the, this is the King Art. So. Oh, fun, yes. You have those. And then you have these. Nice. So it's the whole the whole set. And I tend to use like in the marabou. This is one of my favorites in the marabou. Um I don't know if it lists the color on here. Oh, rose beige mm -hmm. is a beautiful color in the marabou for skin. And then to um, shadow with the terracotta. Oh, pretty. Come on, focus camera. Both this get totally both. remind me of concealer. <laughs> and then there's even darker one if you want to go darker skin. Um, yeah. Is cocoa. And then of course I have black and and white. It was a set that that was the skin set, and it's a black and white, and then. 
those colors. I like it. I like that it's um, it has a variety because you know, not everybody has light skin. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And I found when I started using them and stuff, and and watching videos and learning how to use it, I found that I was making the skin way too light. Yeah. I know I have that issue right now. I'm trying to go darker, but when I go darker, I go orange. <laughs> so I'm right. like really, really light handed. And it, you know, as you guys saw in my mermaid, it's very pale. She's like needed a suntan a little bit. <laughs> but that's where if it's going orange, that's where you can add in gesso and stuff to lighten it up. Mm. Is gesso color have a color? Yeah. It's white, but it's just more like a transparent white, sort of. Okay. So it's going to call anything. If you're doing it and it's coming out way too dark, you can do a complete gesso wash and take all of the color down and reblend. It's just so versatile. An hour. About an hour. Sorry. Husband or son? Son. <laughs> he wants something to eat. I uh, know he already ate, but uh, I don't know what he wants. He just I thought maybe a, a snack or something. He just likes to come in here when I'm live because he knows it irritates me. <laughs> But it's okay. He's a he's a sweet boy. So. At least he's quiet. <laughs> besides, I mean, you know, we all have a life and kids and anybody who gets perturbed about that. Sorry. I was going to say, no, anything goes here, but no, no, everything doesn't go. <laughs> you may not say we're boring. <laughs> no. <laughs> I know I'm boring. I'm fairly new to doing online uh, videos and stuff. And you're not boring. It, it's been hard for me to let loose and let my person out personality out too much. I know that my videos that I'm putting on YouTube are kind of like a robot talking, but it's it's really hard to let loose and just be yourself when you have social anxiety like I do. So I'm getting used to doing it because I've been going live with you, Wanda, and getting to know people in the group. So it's helped me a lot. It made a difference when I first started being able to, um, I, I learned with Facebook, you know, going, I didn't do lives, but I would do my tutorials, record them, and then post them in the group, and then I'd get the feedback. So that's how I got over it. But when I started going, doing the lives, when I started my YouTube channel, um, I started doing live in Facebook to practice for when I got to the point I could do it in YouTube. So I think I'm okay now, but I still stumble. I don't know what to say most of the time. Like, hello, everyone. <laughs> I sound like the robot. Hi, y'all. Wanda here. <laughs> I was doing, I was looking at my YouTube videos just this morning and each one, you know, I'd push play. Hi, Wanda here. Hi, uh, Wanda here. Wanda here. <laughs> I'm like, oh gosh, I need to have some variety. Yeah, we're our own biggest critics. <laughs> so, thank you, Doan. <laughs> and Karen. So, I'm See, the one of those mashups, you know, where you play, like, make a little video of myself and I go, hi, I want to hear, hi, I want to hear, hi, I want to hear, I want to hear, I want to hear. <laughs> <laughs> The problem is I'm on YouTube too much and some of these creators are just awesome at their job, you know? I know. And I'm like, I want to be cool like her. 
I don't edit, so <laughs> that's my biggest problem. I don't, I don't edit. The, the things I have edited, you know, like the 15 second little blip on the foils or, you know, something yeah. that's in forward, but I don't do like normal editing. I don't, mm -mm. I don't know that I'm ever going to be comfortable with that. <laughs> And I don't mind doing editing. I have fun with it. It's just trying to make it more interesting, you know? Hmm. I think I, I like, need... like mine I like to keep real time, I think, just because I like watching it that way. But there's a place, it's all, there's a place for it all, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. even, like I have that four hour one that should be reduced, <laughs> definitely. no sleep sleep oh yeah no yeah susan there would be no sleep <laughs> susan oh i would love that though wouldn't that be cool to like meet up at like this cush cush hotel or something and like have a sleepover in there um i've i've done that before actually um gosh i was in high school and we rented like the conference room at a Hyatt and they, you know, like when you do at prom or whatever, but they let us, um, we all camped out in there for like, I can't remember what my group was though. Oh my gosh. I'm totally drawing a blank. Anyways, it was a high school group that we had and um, we camped out in the, in the conference room, like sleeping bags and pajamas camped out in there. Yeah. It was total fun. I don't even know if they would places do that anymore, but that was forever ago. Like 90, 89, <laughs> Ooh, 90. I don't even know. Man, I should have brought a snack. Oh, so you're in the tunnel again. I know, I right? It, I'm hungry too. Hi, Julie. Cheese it, Julie, your stinker. I love cheese it. <laughs> She's eating Cheez-Its, oh. Katie. Cheez-Its and ice cream over here. See, we need to have somebody over here feeding us snacks while we're working. Right? Jeremy. <laughs> he's on his, he's listening he to it. <laughs> Got it up for you. <laughs> We need snacks. <laughs> There's this one, um, hollow taco. You guys ever heard of it? No. <laughs> it's a nail polish line, hollow taco. She's actually a YouTuber and she started making her own line of nail polish. She is hilarious with a foul mouth. Love her to death. Anyways, um, her, husband's name is Ben and he's like her man slave <laughs> she orders him around to get her tea and snacks and whatnot she's like Ben <laughs> Ben uh, I need tea <laughs> she's hilarious though she uses real nail polish <laughs> and that's cool not she what doesn't much anymore she uses real nail polish like Old school, not gel, not UV. Oh wow! Yeah, you don't see that much anymore. So her her line of holographic stuff is all nail polish, real nail polish, which I think is pretty cool. So you know, because not everybody, it's not safe for everybody to use UV. Like me, <laughs> I can't put it on my my hands. So real nail polish works for me. Now I have to find oh something God. for the 
undergird. Hey, Dan, that's my brother. That's my brother, Dale Martin. That is my brother. <laughs> hey, Dale. Sorry, I got excited. I never seen you on my live before. I apologize. That was me being silly. <laughs> she went crazy. <laughs> I love my brother. <laughs> I love. Hey, I love you like a fat kid loves cake, brother. <laughs> Thank you. Pretty, pretty. All right, so we're gonna do chrome on the forehead. Yeah, I'm just stuck because I have to figure out something for my underneath. Oh, your underwear. The girdle. <laughs> I think I'm gonna pick out some rhinestones when we're doing that. I think I'm going to do a Nito Bandito one. Now, I don't have Nito Bandito ones. Just keep that in mind. Uh-oh. Remember you said that you didn't realize that my rhinestone collection was so bad? Is it on the list? <laughs> no, because I don't know what to get. Okay. I have some rhinestones. Bye, Susan. Bye, Susan. Aren't these cool? My moon turned into a big old thing, so I think I'm going to cover it with a... my inventory was <laughs> her complete your complete inventory we just need it all i agree shay holy crap are you kidding <laughs> we I, just need to know everything you have because we I'm keep married. coming up not having what you have it's all right <laughs> i've been collecting that's all <laughs> She has been collecting for a while. Y'all have to keep that in mind. <laughs> um, I have not been collecting as long as her because she's been at this longer than I have been. <laughs> six years later, I post. Hi, Lisa. I post the inventory six years later. Yes, that's. I'm waiting. <laughs> Look at the. Do you have the Juanitas? Did I know? How many times do you ask me that in a day? I don't know. You know me and my memory. I'm sorry. No, I do not have the Juanitas. Okay, you got the the shell powder though, right? Yes. I have shell powder and I have some other stuff, pigment powders. Okay, I'm gonna use shell powder. In but you can use the Juanita if you want. You you do you, girl. I I don't want to do me. So I'm going to 
um, I'm gonna use the shell powder, but I like this pink. It's pretty actually. I think it's gonna be good. It's good. So I'm gonna do it with top coat. Just a little bit right here. I think I scared my brother off, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I'm out. <laughs> oh, look, you have them in white. Are those black and white or white? What? The foil you're using. It's from this thing. Yep, I think those are the white ones, like these black ones. <laughs> How cool oh. is that? Are you eating something? No, I was, you're, I'm chewing on that. <laughs> it's gross. I'm sorry. I'm I hungry. thought you were eating something. I was like, man, I just said I'm hungry and you're eating something. Ew, no, I'm chewing on the cap of my, my brush. <laughs> sorry. Yes, I'm a straw chewer. Man, I can't get away with nothing right here. <laughs> okay, there's that one. Look at that. Hey, that's pretty. That's the pink? Yeah, it's the shell powder in pink. It's, it's white, but it turns purple. Gotta love interference powders. <laughs> Isn't that cool? These are the Born Pretty. They call it mirror powder. That is number four. So I think in the middle of the body, we I'm going to do these. Uh, you do have these, right? You should. You should have these. If I'm a nice person, you should have these. Yeah, I have those. Oh, thank you. Well, was I nice? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to do the whole middle part, right over the everything. <sighs> Oh, it's sorry. <laughs> We're almost done. So I still have, I'm a little behind. Try to multitask here. Well, I'll be doing rhinestones for four hours while you're <laughs> done. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. No, I won't. I won't do that to you. Sorry. You know, I have to learn how to do something basic, more basic. <laughs> I just think this moth is so pretty and this rock, like, my rock was like, oh, I need to be a moth. You're not. 
basic. Applied- That's the whole deal. I know. I'm just a little more <laughs> extra. Yeah. <laughs> Wanda foil coming up. Thank you, Allison and Lori. What? 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 Ready? Sure, Shay, I don't know. Where are we going? Shay said ready. <laughs> where are we going, Shay? I'm ready. Where are we go? <laughs> I'm wearing rhinestones. <laughs> I'm I'm dressed. <laughs> I have my rhinestones on. Where are we going? Oh, Wanda foil. <laughs> oh, that's right. I said, are you ready for Wanda foil? Here we go. Yay, look how pretty. Wanda Disco Foil. <laughs> I love playing with those. They're like, <laughs> yes, I love the discs myself. They're blinging. I like how you can see through them too. See, gone, they're gone. No, they're not. All right, We're, this one obviously wants to be part of my rock. So, where shall you live? Maybe this one is the one that wants to be in the middle of the... It wants to live there. Thank you. I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> My circles aren't very good circles anymore, but <laughs> it's supposed to be a moon and then. Oh, Katie. What? This would be the perfect time to break out our. The perfect six Beatles gel polish set. Oh. Bum, bum, bum. I was going to do an unboxing. <laughs> I'll still do that separate, but I'll keep it nice. You guys ready? Beatles perfect six gel polish. It comes with a black and white, and these are UV cured. So if you're working on, um, you know, like the geckos and stuff like that, where I did the scales, these work really cool for that. So black, let me show you that. It's extremely black too, it's a nice black, 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 black. And, Oh my gosh, this is so, it's number 581. It doesn't have a name, but I'm going to call it um, beautiful. How do I even show you this? Where's my camera? You to do. How do I make it not focus, but 
it's like holographic. I don't even know how to show this to you. Okay, how do I show it? How do I show it? Okay, I have a, white, a little white thing here. Can you see this? Cameras just don't do this justice. It is gorgeous, but this is so not helping. Oh, maybe I should put a flash on. <laughs> I don't know how to make it. Oh my gosh, it is cool, but this isn't not showing how how cool anyways there's some other colors here i'll show you this one is so beautiful it's like a black with all of the colors like all primaries and golds and everything's in it can you see all those look at that these are going to be cool for fall and christmas stuff halloween stuff like yeah Look at that. Right here, that means it. <laughs> yes, exactly, Alison. Oh my God, is right. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm just going to cure it a little bit so I can set it down. And they cure really fast, too. I love UV paint because it's a commitment. <laughs> Once it's on, it's on. All right, let me do the back side of these with the other two. This is um a gold. The other one's a gold too, but I think one's like gold and one's gold hollow. Yeah, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> They're so awesome, they won't even focus. It looks like it has jewels in it. It's so pretty. So yeah, I was thinking one of those <laughs> in the middle. All of that was about... <laughs> Which one of those shall I put in my in my hollow circle? In here. First one, I agree. Ooh ooh. I have a hole in my glove. I gotta change. You guys wanna see what happens from holes in my glove? It's because I'm allergic. So we want the first one or the black one? 
the black one. I, I, I like the black one. Yeah. Now, should I do the whole circle since I lost my moon shapes? Katie, are you keeping your moon shapes? Yeah. Well, okay, since I'm going to keep my moon shape, then I think I'm going to go with the silver so I don't lose my moon shape. Which the silver is dark too, so. It just doesn't have the red like the black one does. Oops. <laughs> That's funny. What? Not today, you don't nail polish. <laughs> I mean, UV polish. Clean up some of this stuff in my way. So which one should I use? This looks kind of funky in the middle because I put glitter so it's drying. It'll look better once it's dry. Oh, that's beautiful though. I, is that the holo or the glitterific? This is the Naturalis, and then oh, yeah. I used, and then I used extreme glitter on the moon. Oh and yeah. Black. Look at that. So in now, the of those. now I need to figure out what I'm going to put in the circle. Look, I'm seeing. Sorry. <laughs> I think I'm going to use this 582. The black. Yes, that one's so pretty. Yeah, do it. Do I need to, can I use the flashlight with it? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it dries really good like top coat. It only takes a few seconds too. So pretty. The cool thing is, is you can line things with it. You know? I wish I had, um, I wish I could wear this is now I want to put this on my fingernails so bad. <laughs> mm. Right? <laughs> See, does this help anything? <laughs> oh, so pretty. There. See, now I have a fingernail. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nice and hot. <laughs> it is pretty. Look how pretty it is as nail polish. I have nail envy. <laughs> hey, that's it. I'm going to do my gloves. Look how pretty that is. <laughs> yep, I've officially lost it.
there. Now you can see it on a purple finger. So if the purple people eater were to do their nails, there you go. Actually, it would look really pretty on top of purple polish. <laughs> You so crazy. I've lost my standard running stone. Oh no, I didn't. I don't want to be standard. I want to be extra. So, ooh, ooh. Yes, it's beetles. Hang on, I'll show you. But I promise you I'll get you a link as soon as we're done. <laughs> Comes in a box. It's called The Perfect Six by Beetles. Yep, yep. And that was Miss Katie's pick. She got some good eyeballs. Well, and it's funny because you're like, you need some, you need some glitter polish. No, and black and, and white. <laughs> black and black and white. I mean, mm -hmm. um, I meant gel polish and black and white. Yeah. And so I went and look and it was like the first thing i picked and i sent it to her and was like like this and she's like oh my oh gosh my i need those <laughs> sorry, my brain exploded i was like they're so pretty i'm lost what am i doing oh there it is How you doing, Miss Katie? Good. I'm getting my little holy things put in. Your what? Oh, the sequence? No, the no. Yeah. The polish and the 
the little holes. The moon? Yeah. What is that? The sun and the moon? The sun part of the moon? Oh. Need to cure that. Make sure it cures good, better. Gooder. <laughs> what is that? It's gooder. <laughs> You've been saying gooder a lot. It's my it's kid. Your, <laughs> it's your new thing. It's my child. He's been saying it all the time. So now it's stuck in me. Yeah, that polish is taking a little while to cure. I'm fixing to pull out my my other light and just let it sit on it. That's what I'm doing. You just turn your flashlight on and stick it on your rock. Huh? I just turned my flashlight on and left it sit on there. Oh. Yeah, that's good. With gel polishes, guys, you gotta, if you do it in big, sometimes it will never cure because the top cures and then it never cures on the inside. But if they're good, you can get them to cure if you keep the light on it for longer, you know? So there's that. I think um, I'm probably not gonna do it on camera, but I'm gonna add rhinestones, boom, 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 in here too. Or maybe I will. I don't know. <laughs> Can I start setting? Yeah, you, you do your thing. Okay. I'm going to start doing top coat. I'm sealing mine with top coat. And this is Jelixer in a Beatles bottle. I just, it's easier to deal with the small bottle than it is the big, big guy. <laughs> Hi, Delia. Hello. Oh, no yes. one's talking. I know. <laughs> We're tired now. <laughs> We're almost done. <laughs> I was concentrating. I tend to do that. I'm still getting used to these online lives. Yeah, sometimes you get into it and forget. Me too. Sorry. <laughs> 
how about those bears? I'm just so what's the weather like, Dolly? <laughs> hot and steamy. And not the good kind Dallas. of hot and steamy. Dallion. Dallion. You're 5 a.m., Allison. You always stay up all night for us. God bless your heart. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> How is she going to operate? I don't know. I just sent you another package today, though, Missy. Okay. Hey, Jennifer. We were talking about you earlier. <laughs> yes, our famous foil finder. We used that foil tonight. <laughs> yes, I know all about hot and humid. And I had to go to the grocery store today. Yeah. Thanks, Allison. Jennifer, we used one of the foils tonight from the box that you found with the polka dots. We used the stars. Thank you, Lori. Thanks, Lori. My pretty organized foil drawer is now a wreck. <laughs> Every time I, I do a, a rock, my everything goes tornado in here. Like seriously, tomorrow is gonna be I'm gonna be crying. Hope your head's better, Jennifer. Ooh. I'm going to post it on replay, too, so you can watch it again later. I'm sorry you had a headache. Glad you're feeling better. Migraines are no fun. I had one just the other day. My mom has all those air fresheners that spray out. Mm. And she has them all over the house. And so, like, as soon as I walk in the house, it's like instant congestion and sneezing and headache. So, Ooh. I usually go around and turn them all off, but I didn't do that this time. She ought to do a little complimentary tour before you come over. <laughs> yeah, right. We are too in my house. We don't have any smelly good stuff. Not even 
<laughs> the closest thing I have to smelly good stuff is um, lavender calming lotion by Vino. <laughs> That's it. No, we don't live in the same town. We live about what? 40 minutes uh, apart. 30 minutes, 40 minutes apart. Depending on how fast you drive. <laughs> But we're close enough to get to hang out sometimes. She's coming over tomorrow. Yay. I was going to say I'm in a um, college town but you have a college there too so <laughs> they're <Yeah>. everywhere <laughs> i'm in a very large college town yeah and they're they're known to be partiers here <laughs> not me the college kids i only have a bloody mary ever so often <laughs> All right, I'm just going to hit that and then I'm going to pop it into light. Ooh, Shay, Botox. Does that work for my girl? It must work, right? 43? 43. Ouch. 43. I think the needles would make me so nervous. Yes, a Bloody Mary. That's my choice of drink. I love them. You can laugh at me. It's okay. I'm old. <laughs> I just turned 45, so I get Bloody Mary. Uh. <laughs> You know, I completely couldn't figure out how old I was the other day. I was tripping when I figured it out. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. <laughs> and I ain't saying. <laughs> it was just one of those moments, you know. You're not that much older than me. I am finito. I do need, though, to... Well, no, I, I have... I'll, I'll have two, usually. That's pretty much all, it, all I do. I'm a lightweight, but... When I'm on, doing online and I drink one, I don't have time to stop and go make me a drink. Because Wanda's, like, fast. Mm-mm. Oh, I made a boo-boo. I am not. Are you kidding? Have you seen... You're faster than me, I should say. What are you doing to those? I'm sealing them with top coat. Oh, okay. I don't like to seal my whole rock. I know, I know. Well, I love it. I love the way it looks, you know, with them. Because you are, um, you don't Excellent. do, you don't that do means. dropping like I do. And do what? You don't drop the rocks like oh. I do. I do sometimes, but I give them to you to... <laughs> to resin. completely resin. Yeah. Sorry. Thank you. Oh. Wine. Wine tends to give me a headache too, Jennifer, but not all alcohol. Um, there's some alcohol that I can't drink, like tequila, because I can't remember what I did the night before. It, I black out when I drink tequila. So, no tequila for me. I can't drink none of it. None. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not a big drinker. I never was, even when I was young. Yeah, me neither. It just oh. wasn't my thing. 
I may have had a year in there where it was a little more than normal, but that's about it. All right, in the light you go. I was more of um, the hippie route, you know what I mean? So, oh. Well, that's funny. <laughs> should, 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 <laughs> you, think, you don't even know yeah. what to say. I know. I'm like, what? What? Okay. I'm going to leave it. So, it's Seguin. Yeah. It is Seguin. Although some people like call it Seguin or sequin is good i you know i never thought of it that way before but yes i live in sequin because i'm extra so my all my glitter needs to dry so this is about all you're gonna see tonight i don't know if i'm gonna do any um rhinestones I might do something in where these dots are, but I haven't figured out what yet. It's so beautiful. So beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. I put, in case anybody wants to know, um, at the top of the black nail polish that I put, I put Glitterific in Black Opal. It's my new favorite uh, Glitterific. That's gorgeous. So hold it up a little bit so you can see it. It'll look even better when it dries mm -hmm. completely. <laughs> I love it. Yours totally has that um totally has that galaxy vibe. I love it. Yep. Thanks for hanging out with me. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you everyone for hanging out and watching us paint our fun moths. And uh, I'll go ahead and upload this so that we can do a replay later. And um, I'll try to get all of the links for everything posted tonight. If not tonight, I promise you tomorrow first thing, okay? Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you. Hugs. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.